Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, General Hospital. Everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please subscribe and keep watching for more details videos. General Hospital Preview Watch Sunny set a trap for Jason. If you've got it, flaunt it. This week on General Hospital, the it in question is more a who as a certain someone finally returns to Port Charles. And given the amount of excitement about Jason's return, it's not surprising that the show wants to flaunt the hell out of it. As a result, the preview for the week of March 4 to 8 features numerous characters, but only one storyline which can be summed up in two words. Drew confronts Carly about her feelings for Jason, and Jason is aided by spoiler, he's back. Ironically, despite the fact we all know exactly who he is, the latest teaser, which you can watch below, doesn't actually show Steve Burton's Jason. Ugh, sure, technically at the end we see his back, but we never get that money shot of his handsome mug. If we didn't know better, we'd think that the show plans to spend the entire week building up to the big reveal. Perhaps wisely, however, General Hospital will instead give us our first glimpse of the returning actor in the episode airing Monday, March 4. Confession time, how many of us tuned into the Friday, March 1 episode assuming that the Friday cliffhanger would be our actual first glimpse at Jason, only to be disappointed. We can't have been the only ones. Across social media, fans had a whole lot to say about the promo and what it sets up. Rose Lees Wolf told the Facebook audience, I'm happy if Jason is back, but if they brought him back as a bad guy, I'm not going to be happy at all. Others worry about the circumstances under which Jason is returning. With a trap being set to lure the person who's been targeting Sunny out into the open, YouTuber Slouge1086 admitted to being concerned someone, Dant or Chase, might get caught in the crossfire. Many, many others, however, have been asking one very big question, where has Jason been since he was presumed dead in that tunnel collapse? Now we will finally get our first glimpse into the life he was leading while away from Port Charles. Did he, like Sunny during his stint in Nixon Falls, start a whole new life? And how did he seemingly wind up targeting Sunny, the man who has long been his best friend? For more details on exactly what to expect from this week, check out the latest spoilers. And then buckle up as the wild ride gets underway. Which stories soared and which did a crash and burn during the all-important February sweeps? We're looking at what worked last month and what really, really didn't in the gallery below. See whether we felt the same way about the storylines you loved and loathed. General Hospital's Steve Burton reveals we're not getting the Jason return he signed up for. There's been a whole lot of ink spilled speculating on Jason's General Hospital return, from the fans to, well, us. We've all got theories and we've all done our best to follow the clues that the show's laid out for us. Heck, we even did our best to see if the first look photo of his return could reveal anything. Drew confronts Carly about her feelings for Jason, and Jason is aided by spoiler. Now though, we're on the cusp of getting our answers, though it sounds like they're answers that we almost didn't get. When Steve Burton spoke with Soap Opera Digest about his return, he explained that the story they're about to tell isn't what was originally planned. As he was being brought back and the circumstances of his return were being worked out, he explained, there was a head writer switch. So apparently there was a whole different story planned and then the head writer switch happened, and then they kind of rebooted the story. Patrick Mulcahy was brought in, as we know, and longtime General Hospital scribe Elizabeth Court was promoted to co-head writer. Mulcahy's daytime writing career has been extensive, and Nancy Lee Gron is still singing praises about his work on Santa Barbara, but Burton admits he only knew him a little coming back. As for Court, though, the actor shared that, there's no one in the building that loves that show, knows the history of the character, and is invested in it 100% than Elizabeth. There has never been a more deserved promotion, ever. And knowing that she was one of the people working out Jason's return, that was all he needed. I was like, oh, this is gonna be good, I cannot wait, and it has been exactly that. Everything has been amazing. He didn't share any details about what might have been planned, though. As for what the story that brings Jason back entails, Burton's just enjoyed everyone trying to figure it out. I love how invested people are in this, he shared to Digest. I happened to talk to a fan and she was like, so this is what it is. You're doing this, then this happens. I go, hey, guess what? None of that is right. So, watch March 4th. 
Well, March 4th is finally here, so I guess we're about to get our answers. Take a look at our photo gallery of what's next for Jason after his return. Come back to our channel for all your updates. Thank you for watching.